Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna do a video uh, with my Ipsy bags that I haven't done in a little while, so I'm super excited. We are doing Battle of the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, paid versus PR, so I'm so excited. Um, now, nine times out of 10, my boxes or bags that I get um, out of my own subscription are always usually better, which is totally fine because I wanna feel like I'm getting my money's worth. That is what we're here for, is to get our money's worth from these subscriptions. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead. I don't know if I wanna start with my PR or if I wanna start with my one that I bought. Let's go ahead and start with the PR. So I did tie them a little bit differently so I can remember which one was which. This has a little knot in it. So this is the PR Glam Bag Plus. And okay, the first item I see is from Pure Lease. This is the Pumpkin and Ginger Detoxifying Charcoal Mask. That sounds so nice. First of all, we're in November. I want everything pumpkin. I want to feel like it's fall. I love all the smells. So this definitely is right up my alley. I like charcoal masks. So super happy with this. The next item we have is Shades by Shan. Uh, this is a setting spray. Okay, you can always use a new setting spray. This is what it looks like right here. Nice little bottle. Another item we have is from Kenship. This is a hydrating gel cream, cream, cream moisturizer. I want to say like I've gotten that before. Uh, this is a palette, and if you guys know, I love getting palettes, so this is exciting. Uh, this is from Presumita. I'm so sorry, I cannot pronounce this and I cannot read. I can't read that. Can you guys read that? You know what that says? I have no clue. <laughs> so this is a... Oh, oh, a face palette. Oh, okay. Oh, the packaging is very pretty. I like that. I like that a lot better. Like that vintage uh, pinup style tattoo. That's really pretty. These are the colors right here. So it's like a little eye palette. And then, so it's all in one. So you have eyeshadows, you have two mattes, two shimmers, you have a blush, and then you have a highlight. Cute little palette. Um, not something I would like go out and just pick up. Um, but they are pretty colors. I'm really drawn to that purple. It says, uh, Rihanna Rebel unapologetically celebrates our many powerful dual teas with the products that are beautiful as they are fierce. Our multi-use Presumida palette, <laughs> I probably murdered that, uh, includes six attention-getting shades that are guaranteed to give you that regal glow up. We are proud to be a Latina-owned brand offering products that are cruelty-free, vegan, paraben-free, and fulfate-free. Pretty awesome. So, like I said, they're really, really pretty colors, and I love the packaging. I'm not going to swatch them um, because I don't know if I'm going to keep this or not, but I do, I do like it. And the last item we have is from Iconic London, and it's a brush set. <laughs> yes. Um, oh, brushes are almost making me more happy than palettes lately. Did I just say that? Yes, I did. Okay, so these are eye brushes. Eye brushes are my favorite brushes to get. And these are definitely right up my alley. So um, we got some blending brushes, some nice fluffy, bigger blending brushes. Um, and then we have like a pencil brush. Ooh, a lot of powder coming from, I'll have to wash these of course, but yeah, I love getting brushes, so this actually makes me super happy. So, uh, really quickly going over this bag, we got the brushes, we got the palette, we got the charcoal mask, we got the setting spray, and then we got the moisturizer. So, uh, not a bad bag, pretty decent, but let's go ahead and move on to see what we got uh, that I spent with my own money. Okay, so moving on. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Okay, the first item I see, <laughs> I guess they know me very well, huh? 
Uh, this is the Pure Lease Pumpkin Charcoal Mask yet again. So obviously one will be going in my Christmas giveaway, uh, which hopefully I can put up next week, if not definitely the week after. Um, the next item ooh, is a, from one of a kind, this is a Gentle Cleansing Cream. I actually really enjoy getting new facial cleansers uh, through Ipsy. That way I don't even have to go out and buy any more. I am fully stocked. And this is a really nice size. So that's going to last me a little while. Love that. Another item we have is this. It's a hair clip. <laughs> it is a pink sparkly hair clip. Now this actually reminds me of something I would get when I was little, like I begged my grandmother to please get me. Look how cute! I love it. It's pink and sparkly and it actually has a really good grip to it. I love ones that don't feel flimsy. So I can always use a hair clip. I love this. Okay, the next item we have is from Pure. Oh my gosh, okay. So this is the Pure and Nebla. Nebella. I don't know how to say her name. I know who she is, but I don't remember how to say her name, and I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that I murdered that, because I actually do follow her on Instagram. This is the Embrace Your Face Eye and Cheek Palette. Oh, I'm so excited. So... Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. Look. Look at the blushes and the highlights. I love it. Eye and cheek palette. This blush is definitely calling my name. This eyeshadow is definitely calling my name. I know this is supposed to be a highlighter, but that would be a really pretty eyeshadow as well. <sighs> Just a very, very pretty palette. And I like her little message up at the top. Uh, it says, self-love is the best love. So, uh, she is awesome. If you don't know who she is, definitely check her out. Like I said, I follow her on Instagram. And the last item we have, ooh, it's from KVD. Oh, wait, wait, ooh. Okay, hold on. So, KVD Beauty used to be Kat Von D, right? Kat Von D sold her company. They rebranded and became KVD Beauty or KVD Vegan Beauty or something like that, right? Um, the point is, if they're not Kat Von D anymore, this product actually says Kat Von D. So I don't, I don't think they're still using uh, boxes that have her name on it, but this still has her name on it. That's pretty interesting. Actually, you can see it quite clearly on the back, Kat Von D. So I don't know this is if this is in here to like it if they're like here take the rest of the products that have her name on it and they're trying to get rid of it um or or what but either way i'm still actually <laughs> i'm actually kind of excited so this is the everlasting blush in the shade honeysuckle <laughs> this is like vintage then right so i should probably keep that <laughs> look at this look at that packaging Oh, this is back when like Kat Von D's packaging was always on point. It's like a black flower. So freaking pretty. And like a nude blush. We have like a nude blush. This is definitely right up my alley. I love like nude blushes. <laughs> um, I think they're stunning. They're gorgeous. I love how buildable they are. It's so soft. Oh, yes. That gives me life. I love that. Nudes and peaches. Those are like my favorites. So, you guys, tell me what you think about that with it still being in this kind of packaging. Do you think it's them just trying to get rid of uh, the old boxes that they had? Because it's been a while. It's been a while. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I'm still happy. <laughs> Alright, so 
For this bag, we got the Pure Cosmetics um, Eye and Cheek Palette, which is really pretty, wonderful collaboration. Uh, we got the blush, which is beautiful. I love the packaging. Uh, we got the charcoal mask, which I love as well. We got the face cleanser, which I love getting face cleansers in my Ipsy's now. I never thought I would say that, but I'm definitely there. And we got the cute little hair clip, which I always can use a hair clip. I'm always looking for one. So the more I have, the better. Um, but yeah, I don't know, you guys. I think the one that I bought with my own money definitely won this round. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. I'd love to hear your thoughts. So that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like this video, please give it a big old thumbs up for me. I'd really appreciate it. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.